Yes. Synchrony <laughs> injected. Strain level decreased. Dan Lazarski, KPD. Just need to ask you a few questions. You have reached the Rozak residence. How can I help you? Have you noticed anything suspicious lately? Strange types in the hallway? That sort of thing? I did not. Master told me not to schnoop. So this master of yours? Yes. Master Rosak. Master Rosak? Uh, I take it he's not in there. He is not. I can take messages. You always call him Master? I always call him Master. And is he a good master? I'm not sure I understand. Could you restate the question? Is he involved in any criminal activity? I do not possess such knowledge. You're not a bot, are you? Yes, Femcom 6.0. A sex bot. Whoopee. That is an acceptable colloquialism. If Master Rossack isn't home, why didn't he turn you off? I was deactivated following the afternoon session. My CPU rebooted spontaneously five hours and 43 seconds later. The lockdown must have interfered with your power slot. Okay. I'd say goodbye, but I guess there's no point. Yeah. Because that would humanize me. What did you say? Please feel free to use me. PD, I need to talk to you. Shit, are you for real, man? Since when do you pigs give a shit about what goes down in the stacks? Since now, should I take a special interest in you? Hey, man, chill. It's just... Most cops don't have the balls to come down here alone. What you need? Seen anything suspicious lately? Man, ain't nothing here that ain't fucking suspicious. Any outsiders come through here since the lockdown? Hey, I ain't seen no one, but that don't mean they didn't. You know what I'm saying? Fair enough. Later.
Dan Lazarski, KPD. Routine questioning. Daddy, who is it? Can he make the door open? Why can't we go out, Daddy? Shh. Go to your room, kids. Go play Runaway Galaxy. Let me talk to the man. Hello, officer. I'm Thaddeus Karski, head of the family. How can I help you? Everything all right in there? Did the lockdown spook the kids? Oh, no, we're fine. I do appreciate your concern, though. You sound very calm. You're not worried about a potential outbreak? Oh, that doesn't concern us, officer. Of course, I hope that's not the case, for the sake of the other tenants. What do you mean, it doesn't concern you? We're all clean of corruption. My wife, myself, and the little ones. Clean of... oh. You're immaculate. Children of the immaculate birth, yes. You've heard of us. All good things, I hope. Well, I've never been called to a crime scene where one of your kind was involved. That's good enough for me. Our kind? I see. Do you take offense to our way of life, Officer Lazarski? No, but it must be hard on the whole family. No one said life would be easy. Well, I'd have to say, no mods of any kind. That's quite a statement these days. Is it really? Is having a neural connection to the web worth renouncing your humanity? Is a body held together with screws and wires really worth a corrupted soul? Some would say there are benefits. Certainly. I know our lives will be shorter and less comfortable, but it's a price we're willing to pay for experiencing the purity of our God-given bodies. Don't get me wrong, I'm not a big fan of implants, but I couldn't do what I do without them. Yes, you carry them within you. It wasn't really a choice, you know? Oh, but clearly it was. The world would be a better place if more people realized that. Yeah, I guess you're right. Maybe we are what we make ourselves. I don't wish to speak out of turn, but our church has a support group for the penitent and unclean. Perhaps you'd like to attend a meeting? Sounds like a hoot and a half. Thanks for inviting me. Yes, well, once you get past the name, you'll find a lot of compassion and understanding there. Listen, have you seen anything questionable going on around here? Apart from the usual, you mean? The usual? Well, you know, this place isn't exactly a beacon of morality. Still, we mustn't judge. Most people mean well. They're just misguided. All right, if you say so, Mr. Karski. Godspeed, Officer Lazarski.
Hi, this is Tom. And Irene. <laughs> we hope you're having a positively peach.
KPD, can we talk? Ugh. Can I take that as the yes? I apologize, not fully in control yet. Reflex action. What the fuck are you talking about? You don't understand, not surprising. In your condition. You know my condition? Correct. You still have a long way to go. I suppose you're way ahead of me, huh? I am more advanced. Flawed, but nearing completion. Nearing completion? How completely complete are you? 78%. What happens if you hit 100? A big bang? I will be cleansed. Of what? Cleansed of body, purged of flesh, of excess thoughts. If there's nothing left to clean, aren't you a little afraid there'll be nothing? Period? No. Fear is irrational. Change is inevitable. It is more logical to embrace it. Mods don't come cheap. Unless you get them installed in a local fucking ripper clinic. Your logic is sound. But I will not share that information with you. Suit yourself. Oh, and just beware. The lockdown might be the phage. Of course, I know you're way beyond caring. The disease of transition? No. Unacceptable. I am not ready yet. Guess you should have thought about that before you stuffed yourself with mods. Your interrogation tactics are primitive. You call yourself an observer. Yet you fail to observe the basic fallacy in your thinking. How can you be sure I'm an observer? <clears throat> it's much more obvious than you seem to think. Yeah, well, if this is an outbreak, good luck to us all. We're gonna need it. <laughs>